Yo, what up, my nieces and nephews? It's your boy, Robicus, and today, I'm the police! Alright, so the last time we played, we were uh, we did payback, but the Halloween settings were on, so there was like a bunch of zombies. Two of that is actually part of the game. I don't know, but let's just jump right into this one. <coughs> well, sorry about leading you on with the whole promotion thing. On the other hand, you got a lead on the real big fish now, Ray Moreno. The head of the local mafia gang. We've been trying to get at him for years, but he's slipping away every time. Hopefully, this won't lead to anything crazy this time. Too crazy this time. Alright, so... I'm gonna go with the new shotgun. Hopefully, it's really good. Um, and then I'm gonna go with a medkit, obviously. Uh, Lockpick set... Um, foregrip and the breaching kit. Meanwhile, for Jones, I'm gonna give him this. Uh, you know, I'm just gonna give him the last set from last time. Here we go. Hold up, no cutscene? That's strange. Okay, sneak up behind him. Bah! Alright, give me that weapon. Come on. Alright, boroscope. I might be able to sneak up on this guy, who knows. Nope, never mind. Get down. What are you doing? This dude just ran at us. Hopefully there ain't nobody over here. Okay. Let's hit it with the boroscope. Like just a civilian down the hall. <clears throat> Don't say nothing. Okay. All right. I don't see. Ooh, there we go. There's a dude right there. Got him. Very careful. Poor scope. Okay, there ain't nobody in there. So, let's take care of up here first, and then we'll take care of the bottom. Alright, there's a dude right there. Sorry. Boroscope here. Alright. Reloading. Uh oh. Got him. I don't know why he was coming at me like that. Alright, I know there's a dude down here. And a couple dudes coming up right here. Alright, I got him. We got some evidence right here. Here we go. Let's see if there's anyone down here. There's just that guy from last time. Shoot. Alright, we're gonna take care of him or her. Now we gotta check this last room and then. The only other one we gotta worry about is the hostage situation downstairs. Okay, there's this dude right here. We're gonna use this on him. Got him. Okay. I think we got them all. Reloading! Boroscope this. Alright. He is he's got his gun held up to somebody, but that's okay because we're about to blast him. Wow. 
and you get down. Mission complete. All right, let's see what we got here. We got a D plus because we only arrested some of them. We neutralized a bunch of them. We secured all the civilians. I mean, we didn't do that bad. All right, so we had a bunch of unauthorized use of weapons, but I mean, come on. Don't the cops in real life? Hey, what the hell are you goobas even doing here? Ain't it obvious? We're here to arrest you, stupid. Oh, on what grounds? Harlow Chemicals is completely legal business. Check the papers. Listen, the only paper I need is an order with your name on it. And I just happen to have one right here. What? what? An order? It's got to be a mistake of some kind. Listen, I, 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 thought, us, I thought that us and the police had a, mu a mutual understanding. You don't mess with the Colombian business. And in return, we do our part in delivering the equipment. Equipment? What the hell are you talking about? I mean, that's what I... Oh, no. Rick, on his head. Is that a laser sight? What? Uh, p please don't kill me. What happened to protect and stuff? I mean, the cops are supposed to be the good guys, right? Get down on the ground right now. We've unlocked the Magnum and Munition. Alright, now we're going into the next episode. Solitude. <clears throat> I, I can't believe what happened. The reports are horrifying. Doesn't matter what you think until the investigation is over. I think the best option for you would be to take some time off. Hopefully the whole story cools off sooner than later. If nobody blows the whole thing out of proportion. I think the promotion will have to wait. But you both sure deserve a break for a while. Okay, so I'm going to use the last selection I used because it was pretty good. And then I'm going to give him the same thing. So someone shot Marino? Right before you and John got him? That's just insane. Why was this covered up? I remember the report saying that you shot him for not complying with orders. You've been dragged through the mud for that incident for the longest time. Oh, I know that. Remember, a lot of talk about police officers' mental health on TV around that time. With me being a poster child for a trigger-happy cop. You know, to this day, I don't know actually who shot Ray Marino. But in his body, Forensic found the bullet was the same caliber as the gun I had. And that means one thing, and only one thing only. It was all a setup. I didn't know it at the time, but there was a feeling. A feeling that something's been going really wrong. Something I couldn't put my finger on. Or perhaps didn't want to. Ring, ring, ring. Hey, Rick! How are you holding up? You know, I've been butting heads with the Chief for days, but... There's been almost no follow-up on the whole Ray Marino situation. It's like they're not doing anything about it, about this on purpose, you know? Baffling, to be honest. Anyways, it's not all bad news. Have you heard? They've arrested the CEO of Stone and Roberts, Lars Roberts. Apparently, the ledger was found at the casino with the juicer uh, uh, was juicier than we initially thought. Lars is on his way to jail. Something good came out of all this. John. Finally, you said something. I thought you just passed out over the phone or whatever. John, I need to talk to Roberts as soon as possible. Can you come get me from my apartment? We'll drive to the Sullivan County Jail and meet him together. All right. Don't see a problem with that. <clears throat> I'll be at your place in a few. Just be sure to put some, your, on your cleanest uniform. And maybe take a shower? You've been staying at home for days. Bet you smell like a garbage right now. 
You might be right about that. All right, you get five minutes with Roberts, and then a second more. Got it? Follow me. You could tell that this guy was prepared for this. He stayed silent almost the entire time we were here, no matter what we did. And just when we thought all hope was lost. We found C4 with your company name on it, stored in a regular warehouse. Who did you sell it to? He's not going to talk, Rick. Let's just go. For the last time, where? Mm, you have to stop, Stone. What? Stone. Eli Stone. My business partner. Find him. Before anything worse happens. Like what? You'll see. Did you hear that? Yeah, get ready. Attention everyone, there's been reports of gunfire in the city prison. Any available? We're already here, dispatch. We'll deal with this right now. Alright, that's right. Busting in the prison. Kicking button, checking names. Let's go. Don't do it, son. You got your whole life ahead of you. Well, he actually, uh... Went silently. That's kind of cool. Don't do it. Dang it, dude. I said don't do it. Get down. Busted it open. Don't do it. Alright. Here we go. I'm about to blast him in his face. Yep, we got him. There's normally a guy right here. There's a lot of evidence in this room. Get down. Okay, so wait right here, see if anybody moves. Here we go. Somebody's about to get blasted in the face. Got him. Get blasted in the face. Get blasted in the face. Here you go. There's another one right around the corner. Dang. I, I didn't want to have to do that, but they kind of made me. Boroscope, boroscope, what do you see? I see a douchebag, yee yee yee! Okay. Don't do it, son. You got your whole life ahead of you. It's by far one of the smallest prisons I've ever seen, by the way. Anybody here? Anybody there? Anybody down here? Nope, I don't see nobody. Okay. Let's get back to the weapon. Alright, hold up for just a second. Sometimes people decide to move at the last second. Alright. It's fine. Get down. Get down! Horoscope, please. Nobody in here. Okay. Let's hope we can find some ammo.
for some evidence. Okay. Shut up. Under arrest. Okay. So this part is going to be difficult. Got him. Woo! Got him! That's right. Alright, let's see what the storyline has for us now. Mission finished with an F because I killed everybody. Ooh, heavy armor. I'm definitely gonna wear that. And it looks like an M16 of some kind. There was no, uh, there was no uh, cutscene for that. All right. Well, next is search and destroy. Let's go. Why in the world would anyone attack a prison? We're trying to get someone out, or just silence them. Or were they trying to get someone out, or just silence them? Not a single perp confessed so far. So we're left guessing for now. In the meantime, I think you guys should talk to Lenny. He's been real stressed the past couple days. Alright, let's go talk to Lenny. Although I forgot what the Lenny voice was, so... Forgive me? Okay, so... I like that gun, but this is an item it will ensure first and powerful. Fast and powerful shooting, okay. I like this. I'm gonna keep that. I'm gonna keep that. I'm going to keep the breaching kit and the boroscope, but I think I'm going to do heavy armor. <coughs> okay, and for Rick, I'm going to give him this. A... Foregrip, heavy armor. He doesn't really use much of anything else. Um, so I'll just give him random stuff. Okay, cool. We didn't know who attacked the prison. The thugs didn't know who the order came from. Our only lead was Eli Stone. And he disappeared from public eye after Robert got arrested. We were back to square one, and I was almost out of options. Almost. What? What do you mean Lenny's not there? Yeah, we let him go. Chief's orders were to get rid of him, out, uh, to, to get him out of the precinct. So we just kind of let, let him out. You can't be serious. When? Actually, he left a few hours ago. Heard him mentoring something about, uh, mem uh, mentioning something about an arcade while he was talking on the phone. An arcade, huh? I know the place. Let's go. Alright, so we're gonna have a shootout at an arcade now. This is crazy. This game just gets nuttier and nuttier. Don't do it. Don't do it, son. You got your whole life ahead of you. Alright, let's boroscope the heck out of this. Alright, he don't count, so don't worry about him. Yeah, get down. I totally did not want to have to shoot him, but it happened. Boroscope again. Alright, blue lady, I don't see anything else, so... Get down! Get down! They got a pretty good soundtrack on this game, I'm not gonna lie. Okay. Boroscope again. Alright, there's a thug looking dude that I can cap almost immediately the second I open this door. Got him. 
He heard something, he said. Oh, shoot. Stand out. Get him, bro. Okay, so that was awkward. Got him. Uh-oh. Got him. I think my partner dies a little too easy in this game. A little too easily, if I might say. Okay, so... RELOADING! Alright, so, boroscope, boroscope, what do you see? Do you see a douchebag? Yee yee yee! Nope, I don't see one. I apologize for the reading during the cutscene. Sometimes I read a little faster than my brain goes. My hip must give it is. Alright. See if the boroscope will catch anything else up here. Yeah, there's a guy there. I don't see nobody else. Hopefully he's it. Man, that guy thought he was slick. Just standing there with his gun. Okay. That looks like a bowling alley. Alright, boroscope, boroscope. Alright, yeah, I don't see nobody in here either. There ain't nobody in the hall. <coughs> I did not take the lock pit this time. That's okay, I have heavy armor. Should help me out just a little bit more. Get down. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure you don't know anything. I think this is the last room. Let's see. Uh, just a civilian. Odd. Don't do it. Don't do it. You got your whole life ahead of you. Mission finished. Dang, that was a quick one. Alright, let's see what happens next. All clear, and Lenny's nowhere to be found. Hmm. Hey you, where's Lenny? We know he was here just now. You know where he went? Where he went to? Yeah, yeah I do. How about a deal? I tell you guys where he went, and you let me go. Not a chance. Hey, it was worth a shot. Anyway, he told me that. His boss changed the location of their meeting. He's in a life in hometown strip club, a couple blocks away from here. The who kind of name is this? I don't know. I think it's ki it kind of works though. Whatever. Let's not waste any time. All right. Sweet. Um. Oh, okay, so it looks like I... Was that it? Arcade Center? Oh, crap. Alright, so I didn't... Um, I didn't gain enough points to unlock uh, the reunion. So I'm going to play it again. You guys don't have to watch that. And then we'll start on level 12. I mean, we got quite a, we got quite a bit left, though. But yeah, we'll, we'll get back to 12 here soon. Okay. Cool. Um, I'm going to redo this and I'll be right back with you guys in a minute. Alright y'all, I'm back and now we have the reunion. Alright, so let's uh, hope we can beat this one and have enough points for the next one. <laughs> Rendezvous with Lenny Wolf at the Life and Hometown Club. Be cautious. The club is guarded by gang members and there's a lot of them. 
Looks like they're guarding something or someone. Couldn't be who I think it is, right? Well, we're about to find out. No cutscene again. Okay. Alright, we're going to the strip club. Don't do nothing dumb. Please don't do nothing dumb. Oh man, I do not like where this is going. Yeah, I know you're not afraid of me, but just don't do nothing stupid, okay? I don't want to have to shoot you, man. Just be cool. Dang it. Bro, come on. I'm trying to be a good cop here. Don't do it. Come on, man. I'm trying to be a good cop here. Get enough points to get to the next level. Okay. Ain't gotta worry about much here. He doesn't shoot. Let's just make sure nobody's smoking outside. Alright, so the private dance rooms are back there. Let's check the bathroom. It's alright, I can come up behind him. Bop! Get down. Okay, I can't get on the stage. It's probably for the best. Alright, let's see what we got in here. Alright. Nobody to worry about. How about down here? Okay, cool. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. Just chill. Okay. Boroscope here. Okay. There's only one guy in this room. Shut up. trying to do this as quietly as possible. I don't see nobody in here. Oh shoot. Did not mean to do that. And I think I alerted somebody. Ah, shoot. I did not want to have to do that. Okay, I don't see anybody in the back office. So that's kind of a good thing for us. Okay, alright. So ladies in the restroom. Don't do it. Just in case. All right, let's borescope this. Okay, now let's check the bathroom. Let's check the restroom for anything suspicious. Shoot, we're gonna have to shoot him. He pulled his gun out. I had to shoot him. He pulled us out. Uh, uh, <coughs> sorry. A little congested. Can't even fake rap right now. I'm gonna hit these guys with the pow. I'm gonna shoot them in the face. Maybe spray them with some mace, cause I'm the police. I'm the best. Everybody calls me Adam West. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, guys. I apologize. For my terrible rapping. Okay. I'm gonna boroscope this. Doo -boo -doo -boo -boo. All right, cool. This level is actually kind of intricate. Nobody back here. Okay, there's just a dude. Let's 
fine. Just get down. It's gonna be alright. Looks like they shoot porns back here too. Look at this. Okay, I don't see nothing there. So now it's time to go to the private rooms, which is probably gonna be the most dangerous area for us. Check the hallway first. been really bad for us. <coughs> sorry, about the, sorry about the cough, guys. Wait up, you can have sex with the, with the strippers back here? Dang it. I ain't got no more, uh, Ain't got no more med kits, so. Ah, shoot, that would have been really bad <coughs> if he had got me. Last door, guys. That's oh, just a random lady. Don't do it. You got your whole life ahead of you. Mission complete. Alright, let's see what happens. <clears throat> and we got a C plus. Man, we just can't win with these people. I got injured once. Unlike Roberts, this guy broke down. Even before we started talking. <clears throat> Turns out, he was working for none other than Eli Stone. The guy's crazy, I'm telling you. Threaten to kill my family and all. Listen, I've got to tell you, you guys, something important. Three bombs were planted around the city today, the same way as with Stan's Winskis. And all this time, I was drugging, and I was the drugging scapegoat. Civilians. Wait, I was drugging the scapegoat. Oh, God. I apologize for my bad reading, guys. I was drugging the scapegoat civilians. That? That's nuts. Why, why are you helping him? Why the hell is Eli Stone planting bombs around the city? I needed the money, man. Besides, if I refused, they'd kill me and my whole family. Eli's crazy like that. As for why, I don't know, man. All I know is that they're set to explode tonight. I'll get you all the info, names, places, whatever you want. Just, just stop him, man. Please. <clears throat> Right on. And we got a tear gas grenade. Nice. Alright, y'all. So, um, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe if you want to. I'll see you guys in the next episode of Police Story. Story of the Police. Huh.